backtrack a little bit. In 2011, you received a $1.5 million uh, grant from the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation for a project in Africa. Can you talk a little bit about uh, that project? Sure. Uh, the, the project, the main objective of that project was to uh, convert fecal sludge, uh, uh, mostly domestic, uh, which is mostly domestically obtained, so fecal sludge into something uh, which, which is uh, which is valuable, for instance. And so a, a very typical endpoint for fecal sludge conversion has been biogas. And biogas for perhaps uh, use in uh, cooking, for instance, and that, that people have been doing for centuries. What we wanted to do was uh, go beyond the conventional endpoints, what we, what we really know, uh, perhaps even to higher value endpoints. And so we, we wanted to look at biodiesel as an endpoint. Because again, biodiesel uh, is very, very promising in terms of uh, its utility as a fuel uh, and uh, we were also thinking uh, along the following lines uh, in many parts of the world uh, the lack of sanitation is, is not driven by lack of uh, financial resources sometimes it's also driven by the lack of available energy locally so we wanted to let's say convert fecal sludge into let's say biodiesel uh, and then maybe partially also the energy demand of uh, of uh, fecal sludge conversion itself. So our objective was uh, not to not to uh, uh, make biodiesel to compete with the biodiesel industry, but our objective was to make biodiesel to perhaps render the model of sanitation more accessible uh, to to broader communities. Now, how has life improved there? Where exactly was this project in Africa? This yeah. So this was in Ghana. It was uh, it was in the city of Kumasi, okay. which is uh, which, which is one of the biggest cities in in Ghana, and uh, this was a pilot project. Uh, and so we were the, the scale of the project is important to mention. Uh, the, the the system uh, I designed was uh, capable of accepting fecal sludge from about five to ten thousand people per day, uh, and so that's that's what to biogas. Uh, uh, it, it just just uh, happens that we we, uh, we didn't really understand what fecal sludge was in terms of its biodiesel potential, and we had uh, overestimated uh, our our our, our uh, yield of biodiesel. But f even from this setback, I think we uh, there was a positive in the sense that we developed an even more robust process to make biodiesel. Now, this year, you were given another grant. You were given a grant uh, in the amount of two hundred twenty-five thousand dollars for transforming wastewater uh, to commodity chemicals, energy uh, sources, and, um, and fertilizers. Is this a project that's, uh, that's going to be done in the U.S.? Watch the remaining show on ITV Gold. Subscribe to ITV Gold on Time Warner Cable Channel 1539. ITV Gold is America's first full-time television channel that caters to the South Asian community. Your favorite dramas with English subtitles. Watch movies, back-to-back -back songs, award-winning local news coverage, and much, much more. Subscribe to ITV Gold on Time Warner Cable Channel 1539, part of the 8-channel combo pack for $39.95. And our East Coast viewers can also subscribe to ITV on RCN Channel 476 and Cablevision on channel 1168.